Good morning. Day 15, starting off not the way I planned, <clears throat> but it's starting. I don't have any ginger this morning. I'm not going to the gym today. I'm pretty sure I'm suffering from a fibromyalgia flare up. It's just because probably we just did too much this weekend, so now my body's trying to recover. But I can literally like hear the blood moving through my body. I'm gonna make a lemon and water shot, and then I'll take that. going to go ahead and make my chicken tea and fast forward because of course it's the same shake I make every day if you haven't seen the recipe it is explained in day one and two vlog my baby boy is not feeling good so I'm gonna go ahead and make this real quick almost forgot to do this first before I have my shake super greens responsibilities of the day. So I'm gonna take it really, really, really easy today because I don't want my flare to be worse tomorrow. I want it to be gone. Like my hands are swollen, my face is swollen, my legs hurt, everything hurts. I have knots in my back, it's kind of crazy. It's crazy, but it'll pass and I'm just gonna take it easy today but still stay on track with my nutrition. So I will still share what I'm eating. So happy day 15 and I will see you guys when it's time to eat again. Bye. All right, so I just got back from dropping Kamar off to her dad because she has practice. I missed my morning snack. I don't really feel like eating right now. It's time for a healthy meal, but I really just don't feel like eating. I'm not feeling my best at all today. And neither is AJ, which I feel really bad. I kind of think he has a rotavirus. He may have gotten it from one of the kids at the gym, so I can't take him back to the gym until he stops having symptoms. As for right now, I don't feel like working out and I'm gonna listen to my body so I don't like kill myself. Make a smoothie. I guess I'll make a smoothie. And then I'll start prepping. I'll bring you guys with me to prep. Okay, you guys, I'm going to go ahead and make a smoothie really quick so that I can start meal prepping um, while I have the time. So what I'm going to start with is, y'all know I'd be freezing my leftover produce. So I have kale, strawberries, and a tiny piece of a banana in here. I have this super fruit, antioxidant super fruit acai, frozen. And add this in here, it's a big frozen stick. I'm just gonna add that in the side. This. this. I have my baby spinach, baby lettuce, and baby greens mix. I have one handful of this in there. Three fourths of some sweetened vanilla almond milk, just enough so that it can blend, you know. Some protein, some chia seeds. This is the vanilla bean Greek yogurt. This. This is what it looks like. like a superfood smoothie and this is going to be my first snack of the day after my shake now I'm going to meal prep and sip on this all right so I took everything out and I was getting ready to prep 
foot. Unfortunately, I had to take little man to the hospital. So, I'll talk to y'all soon. Okay, we're home from the hospital late now and I am not, not preparing this sh stuff tonight. I look at the bags under my eyes. I have a filter on my phone, but you can still see them through the filter. That's how bad it is. My husband is getting the kids happy meals. Don't judge us. We ordered um, Mohana bowls. They're, it's kind of like Fresh Kitchen, but it's this place in Brandon. It's just like Fresh Kitchen. I'll show you guys when it gets delivered. But while I'm waiting for it to get delivered and he took the kids to go get happy meals, I'm going to do the bare minimum of prepping. I'm going to clean the stuff to make salads so I can make his lunch for work tomorrow and also be a little prepared for tomorrow. This Monday is definitely Mondaying because nothing like went as planned. And now AJ, he was diagnosed with the virus, so can't go to the gym for a couple days because obviously um well, that's where he caught it. He caught it at kids club at the gym from another kid. And I don't want to be that parent who is spreading baby germs because I want to go get workout. It's not that serious. So, I mean, I always do at home workouts or whatever, but I'm not about to drop my sick baby off in childcare so I can go work out for an hour. So, you won't be seeing me in the gym, unfortunately, but I'm still going to share all my food. So... I'll do it and fast forward. All right, so y'all know I'm trying to keep my liver healthy, right? I heard that if you juice celery, it's good for you. And I didn't want my celery to go bad, so I decided maybe I should just juice it just to see how it goes. It smells so celery. This is all celery. It'll be on me. You'll see me juice it. But hey, our food just, just, our food just got here. Well, they're approaching. But look, this is all celery juice. So tomorrow, instead of my shot, I'm going to try drinking that. We'll see how that goes. It's not bad. It's not bad. It tastes like celery. It's literally liquid celery. Yeah, it is. They're approaching me not here yet. I mean, it's not bad, it's but, not I don't bad. Know, but to drink this whole thing, <laughs> yeah, you got to just take it to like the it's end. not a shot. Like you have no. to just drink this. Yeah. Don't think to see me drink this first thing in the morning. And then we'll continue our shots the following day. Or maybe I'll just take a shot later in the day. It's funny. Huh? It feels funny. I know. That's not like I wanna drink this whole thing and then drink a shake nah, and then drink I, some tea. Nah, I don't think so. Nah, I don't think so. <laughs> like you gonna drink that and you're not gonna wanna drink anything else. Maybe I shouldn't drink it on the first thing in the morning. Maybe I'll stick with my shots and then like this. Nah, I'll just not, like drink this over ice. But that's not the prescription. But this is nasty. <laughs> Anyways, not good. so that was, yeah, right, it is medicine, for real, out the ground. But, oh yeah, it's another thing, because I got my results today about the um, cervix, and there's like absolutely no cancer cells anywhere. So that's a good thing. But, so that's all I'm prepping today. I'm gonna clean out my big mess and then I'm going to eat. And then I'm going to, um, <laughs> they speak different languages. And then I'm gonna eat our food that literally just got dropped off at the door. I will save the chickpeas and the asparagus. The food's out there. And the sweet potatoes for tomorrow.
Okay, my food was delivered. This is what I got. And so this is what I'm eating for dinner. It's late. The whole hospital thing kind of threw everything off. So I doubt I'll have a night shake, which I know is bad because the magic is in the second shake. I already know. But life is life and life is not perfect and I am not perfect. So this is what I'm going to eat. My husband got one too, but his is different. He got cauliflower rice and chicken. That looks funny. Yeah, it does. Look how curdly that looks. It looks vomity. It's coconut. <laughs> Ew, that looks like AJ diaper. <laughs> All right, we're going to eat now. Bye. All right, it is late, late, but I am drinking a tea and getting some work done on the computer while everyone is laying down. So. I'm gonna drink my tea, do this, and go to bed. So that will conclude today. I'm gonna get better with my two shakes a day, I promise. Just a little step back, but life is gonna life no matter what we do. So we just gotta do our best, and that's what I'm doing. So I will see you guys on day 16 tomorrow. It's day 16, isn't it? Sure is. All right. See you in the next video.